What's up, YouTube? So, let's talk about some stuff real quick. In every relationship, there's a default. I don't want to quite call it a default, but... <laughs> there's a... Called jealousy. And I don't mean to call it a default, but... I don't know. I guess it is. Uh, a lot of people get mad about jealousy and stuff like that. I don't. I don't get mad at all. Uh, I think after you're with somebody for a long period of time, the jealousy kind of goes away because you're not worried about who they're going home with, what they're doing, stuff like that. But I think a little bit of jealousy is good in anyone's relationship, anyone. And either the woman's side, the man's side, both sides. Anyway, so, hang, let's get on the interstate. Long story short, this is what happened. Savannah and I go out last night and we're eating at uh, Buffalo Zebulon Road. <coughs> uh, I don't know if all Buffaloes are the same, but I know they're all franchised up under one franchise name. Like, you know, you got Buffalo, Buffalo Wild Wings, Buffalo Cafe. All of them owned by the same people. Now, somebody can own the franchise name kind of like, you know, not all McDonald's are owned by the same people, you know, but it's still a McDonald's. So you got Chili's. Well, let me, let me, let me redo that. TGI Fridays, Applebee's, and I believe Chili's is owned by the same corporation, the name is. Now you can buy into that franchise and you can either own a Chili's, a Applebee's, or or TJ and Fridays. Anyway, fuck it. So we were out at Buffalo's, um, and we were eating. And this little girl I know, I don't mean to call her a little girl. This young lady I know, she came up and started talking to Savannah and I, and. No, we just started talking, like me and her old friends. And I introduced her to Savannah. I'm like, hey, this is my girlfriend, Savannah, da 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 Now, we've been together seven years. Seven long years. And, you know, I usually introduce her as my wife, which this time I say my girlfriend because this is a young lady who knows I'm not married. Uh, she knows my family. Like, we, we go way back. And I guess uh, Savannah took it as an insult or, oh, I didn't say we were married because maybe he's got a thing for this girl, whatever. So anyway, man, this girl was kind of on conversation. I could tell Savannah was getting like uh, pissy. So I cut the conversation short. The waitress came up. She walked away, whatever. And like I said, some jealousy is good. It makes you feel, because after you're with somebody for, like I said, seven years, you expect the person you're with to say, I love you. You expect the person you're with to say, oh, you're cute. You look like you're losing weight. You're looking good. Your muscles are getting bigger. Whatever. You expect that from them. So when they say it, it doesn't mean a lot. But let jealousy pop his ugly head, and you know. You know what I mean? You're like, mother fuck. She still has it for me. You know, she still likes me. She's still in love with me. She still gets jealous over me. And that made me feel good. <clears throat> now me, I'm not a jealous dude. But, 
I don't text any other females. I don't message any other females. I don't do nothing with no other females. I have female friends I rarely talk to. Out of respect. Savannah and I have been together seven years. Out of respect. Yeah, I see them in public. I talk to them. We friendly. We, you know, whatever. You know, they want to hang out. Well, you know what? You get me and my wife. You don't get just me. You get her, her too. Uh, but, and I expect the same thing. Well, Savannah's had this uh, this little boy messages her her on Facebook that uh, she works with. They talk about work shit, whatever. Well, then he's like, "Oh, well, here's my here's my number. Here's this. You know, call me, text me whenever you want." And kind of really pissed me off. Because she let it sit there for a couple of days. She didn't message him back. Well, not a couple of days. Like a couple of hours. I guess she was trying to figure out how to say what she needed to say. Without coming off an asshole. But at that point in time, I manage bars. I do security at bars. I'll let you know real quick. She wears a ring. I wear a ring. We're not engaged. We're not married. We've been together for seven years. And there's a whole lot behind why we're not married and why we're not engaged. And that's her family. But that's a whole other thing. But anyway, so it really pissed me off. I didn't say nothing to him. I said something to her. I was like, it's kind of fucked up that you still haven't messaged this boy back. And been like, hey, look, you know, we can talk about work all day. Other than that, that's all we need to talk about. So she finally sent him the message. And that was my jealous side. Now, her jealous side last night, oh my God. Kicking and screaming like a little three year old. You know, fucking pissed off, cussing me out and everything else. And it was like, oh, I could tell the way y'all were looking at each other. Da 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 da. The way she hugged you. Da 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 da. But she was with her boyfriend. Now, granted, she told Savannah, I don't use the boyfriend label. And I don't use a girlfriend label. Because they're, they're not dating, but they're dating you know what I mean so I guess they're just dating they're not labeled yet but I mean they're all over each other and in a restaurant just kind of trashy but whatever floats your boat I'm not here to pass judgment on nobody on how you handle your business but don't be like suck a tongue in the middle of a restaurant that's kind of kind of fucked up that shit you should do at your house or at a bar when you're drunk or you know, at your own time, not everybody's face while kids are around and shit like anyway, anyway. So she got mad, she you know, she's doing her little thing and well I could tell, you know, the way y'all look at each other, y'all like each other, her boyfriend even looks like you, which is true. This dude had a bald ass head, maybe was 50, 60 pounds lighter than me. Not as much muscle as me, but yeah. We, we would pass as maybe twins or brothers or cousins. I mean, we look that much alike. But so do I and every other big bone, ball-headed, bearded guy around. But anyway, like I said, a little jealousy is good jealousy. A lot of jealousy is bad. Because if they're jealous too much, it means something's going on other than what's really going on. So I'm gonna cut this short, it's already eight minutes. I'm about to pick Savannah up now. I'm gonna redo a video later, uh, hopefully. Depends on how shit goes. I don't know what we're gonna do, but shit's bound to happen. Uh, I got some more stuff I gotta upload, move around, put some, put some music to, whole nine yards. But y'all have a good one, man, y'all be safe. Uh, please like, please comment, please, you know, share. Have a wonderful day.